Pisces and welcome to your reading. So please keep in mind that this is a general reading. It will not resonate for everyone. Okay, let's get started. So five of pentacles. So this talks about a breakup, a separation. Someone being left out in the cold. Being at a distance from one another. Two of Wands in the reverse. So someone um, is just thinking about this, okay? But they're not taking action. Nobody's taking action towards, you know, the other person. Things are pretty much at a standstill for now. The spirit, tell me what it is I need to see. Queen of Pentacles. So this is Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. This is a very nurturing queen, a nurturing mother, very stable, very grounded, financially stable. Nine of Cups. So someone knows here, okay, who they want to be with. They know who makes them happy, who is their wish fulfillment here with the Nine of Cups. But they feel left out, okay, in the cold. They're probably not happy about that. the queen of cups this is your card pisces it could be also scorpio cancer so there's a lot of love here this is unconditional love this queen is very loving and emotionally stable it could be the same person as the the queen of pentacles but just different energies the Seven of Cups. This could talk about someone having a lot of options. Okay. Or someone looking at all the possibilities here. To, uh, to come towards you. Okay. To see how they're going to come towards you. Yeah. Or even though they have a lot of choices, they know that they want to be with you. They know that you are their wish fulfillment. Because they have a lot of love for you. Okay. So, Knight of Cups. In the reverse, so someone does have a lot of love, but they're not expressing it. Okay. There might be an obstacle here. Okay, that prevents them from expressing how they feel. Okay, let's continue. Please, Spirit, tell me what it is that I need to see for Pisces, the hangman. Yeah, this person is on a break here. Okay. You're probably both because, you know, while you're separated, you're, you know, you're trying to uh, look at this relationship. Okay from different angles having a different perspective okay letting things go naturally not pushing it and or forcing it just you know go with the flow and see where it goes eight of one so right now there's just you know it's just thinking and no action the eight of uh, ones in the reverse so someone who wants to communicate but for now it, things are stagnant here okay the spirit 
the Ace of Swords. So someone wants a new beginning here, okay? It's about truth, honesty, okay? And they know, they know, you know, who they want to be with. They have clarity. This is about clarity, okay? While they're thinking, you know, and they're, they're trying to see like how to move forward, you know, they're going to have clarity about the situation here. Four of Cups in the reverse, so someone is not happy and wanting to go towards their wish fulfillment. Could be you, could be the other person. They're thinking about what was lost, okay? Maybe you rejected them, they rejected you. But someone is, is not happy with the breakup here. The world, so endings and new beginnings, and they want a new beginning with you. The spirit, okay, I just saw the Ace of Cups, so Page of Wands in the reverse, so no action. This just confirms that, you know, things are at a standstill, but this person does want to communicate, I mean... They know that they want to be with you, but the Empress in the reverse. This could be the same one as the Queen of Pentacles, you know, because it's a nurturing mother, very grounded. And the Page of Swords. So while they're on the break here, they're spying on you through social media. Okay. Wanting to break the silence. The King of Cups in the reverse. This is unconditional love. Someone has a lot of love for you, but they're not expressing it. It could also talk about alcohol addiction, okay, but it doesn't have to be. So someone wants to break the silence and, you know, express how, how they feel. Judgment. So someone needs, you know, to do some healing here. Okay, this is the universe telling them that, you know, it's like a, a wake up call here that they need to, to change something. Okay. They need to change something for this rebirth to take place here. Okay. But there's still, you know. There, there might be some resistance, okay? They know what they have to do. They have clarity, but they might be resisting, okay? This change. And they, they might think that just, you know, taking a break and letting things go naturally, that things will, you know, eventually work out. But I think this person will have to take action, you know, in the future. The Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So this queen usually takes action, okay? It's very action-oriented. So someone needs to stop thinking and take action here. The Moon... So secrets here, okay, and again, not express, not expressing their emotions, wanting this new beginning, but not, you know, 
Okay, the spirit. Three of Cups, yeah. Reconciliation. This just confirms that, you know, this person wants a reconciliation with you. They're probably thinking a lot about you. Justice wanting to make things right. Okay. They might be feeling also the consequences of past mistakes if they want to make things right with you. Whatever happened between you. The Emperor. So we have the Empress and we have the Emperor here. Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine or Masculine Energy. Feminine Energy. Okay. This is Aries. Okay, the spirit, the tower, yeah. So this person will have to go through this tower because the universe, you know, <clears throat> was giving them signs that the, the tower was going to come here. So it's time for change, letting go of things that do not serve you. And making room for new beginnings, okay? So whatever happened in the past, you need to let go because it was not working out, right? And if you, this person wants to reconcile, they, you know, they cannot make the same mistakes. They have to learn from their mistakes, okay, and change so that you can start new. The sun. <clears throat> so this just confirms that this person, you know, they, they're not happy where they are right now. Yeah. They're not happy here. And they want to come towards you. Okay. But they need to. To change their their behavior okay the four of pentacles so not letting go of this connection okay wanting to find stability this could talk also about saving money The Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. So someone is holding on to this. And um, <clears throat> they probably don't want to be single anymore. And they want to come towards you. They don't want for you to be single anymore. But they'll have to express how they feel, right? Okay. That devil, yeah, there was some, you know, toxic behavior there that they needed to change. And they'll have to confront this, okay? It could be addictions. I, yeah, there was the king of cups here <clears throat> in the reverse. This could be someone with alcohol addiction, maybe. The Knight of Pentacles. So someone wants stability here. Okay. And they want to offer it to you. But this is going to take a long time. But once it gets there. Okay. It's for long term. But it will just. You know. It requires patience here. Because this is a, a very slow moving offer. the fool so wanting to take that leap of faith in reverse it talks about delays there's this delay here because someone needs to go through this tower and transform
the eight of pentacles okay there might be some resistance they might not want to put in the work so someone is resisting this tower here okay but they're manifesting this magician okay they really want this but they'll they'll have to put in the work okay they'll have to put in the effort and make that change five of wands so they want to they want to make peace with you they want you know to come out of conflict with you This is the, the message that they're going to send you in the future, okay? It might not be a very emotional message. They're probably not still not going to express how they feel, okay? But they're 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 going to communicate with you. Okay, for the spirit for Pisces here. Okay. The seven of wands. So this talks about letting go, releasing, okay, not being guarded. So under the devil here, I think this person's finally going to release this, you know, toxic energy. They're not going to be guarded, they're not going to resist anymore, okay they're going to let go and and yeah and release that that's how yeah i think that's what's going to happen here that's how i feel it they know that they'll have to do that if they want to you know reconcile with you because you'll probably not accept them you know with this toxic behavior because then the, the same pattern is going to repeat again, right? So if you if you want to make things work, you need you know, this person needs to let go of, of things that you know that will prevent you from coming together. But it might take some time because maybe he's still in denial about this, you know, if he's still in this, you know. But eventually he will he will stop resisting this. Okay. Yeah, beautiful. So new cycle, then this new cycle was will start. Okay. And it's you know, it's for the better. So it's a positive change. So this person will realize that, you know, it, because the tower is, is painful. I, you know, change is, is painful. Having to release, you know, toxic behavior. It's very painful. It's not an easy process. But it's better to not resist, you know. And once you get out of that, then, you know, there are beautiful things that are going to come out of that. It's very positive. They just need to realize that, you know, have the courage to make that change. And once they do, you know, there's stability here, okay? There is emotional fulfillment. And there is love here. There's a lot of love because there's the Queen of Cups, there's the King of Cups. Yeah. There's a lot of love here, you know, but this person is just, you know, I, they they still need to, you know, to go through. I think they, they have not gone through this tower yet. So we'll require, you know, patience here with the Knight of Pentacles, you know, the, the slow moving offer.
Okay, so for the signs we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and here's your, your card again, Pisces. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Libra, Gemini, yeah, so that's it, Pisces, so I hope you enjoyed your reading, I hope it resonated, and see you next time, bye.